A shorter term lease may be the way to go in the current market. Now, as you've been shopping lately, I know payments are still really high. Last year we were dealing with market adjustments and so prices were just ridiculous. Those have pretty much gone away. Dealers now have discounts and rebates, which is great. But unfortunately the cost of money, interest rate, the Fed raising interest rate is making those money factors on leases high, just like interest rates are high. So now that the market adjust adjustments are gone, the, the cost of money is still making those payments on them 36 month leases higher than we'd like to be. They're definitely getting better, but not where we want them to be. And the, the cool and strange thing is, which you know, this is totally new, is that 18 month leases, 24 month leases, now can have better payments than the 36 month leases. In the past, that was not the case. You know, a car usually depreciates the most in the first two years. So when you would have a shorter term lease before, you were spreading, you didn't have as many years to spread out that depreciation. There's a lot less depreciation in the third year. So, you know, the, the, the historical, you know, understanding is that a three-year lease is a lower payment than a two-year lease or even an 18-month year lease. But because used car values are still sky high and they keep going up at wholesale auction, dealers are having to pay top dollar for these used cars. So they're willing to pay you top dollar for your used car. And because of that, on a shorter term, 18 month lease, they can keep the residual value really high because they don't expect that car to lose as much value as it would have before. So because of that, you have to pay less depreciation in those first two years or even 18 months. So really right now, if you're looking for a lease, at the best payment, I highly recommend you go and start looking at maybe an 18 month or a 24 month lease, which is which is crazy to say because that's not how it normally is, but this is the world we're living in. And where I've been seeing those deals, the best ones are out of Nissan and Infinity, but I'm sure the other, the other captive finance companies, the other leasing companies and manufacturers are probably doing something similar. I mean, their cars are gonna hold value um, in the short term. So they're trying to, you know, they're trying to minimize risk. They're still trying to sell cars. I know the prices on the normal three-year leases are really high, but go ahead and take a look at some 18 month and 24 month leases. You really might find a payment that's much more reasonable, much more in your budget, and you might be able to get a car, you know, now as, as opposed to waiting. Um, if that was helpful, please like, please subscribe. My name's Adam, the lease guy. Check out my link for my services. I'd love to help you.